I'm in Galeano, Louisiana, waiting for Hurricane Isaac. And radar shows that the northwest eye wall is approaching this area, so we should get hit pretty good in the next couple of hours. flirting with a calm. It's trying to calm down, but it can't quite. When I look on the radar, I could see that just a mile or two outside of the eye, if it would just get a little closer, the wind would die down completely. It's about 1 a.m. and it's really calmed down. Not completely, but a lot. Looking at the radar, it looks like I'm just clipping the northern part of the eye. So I'll have a brief, uh, a brief break from all that. And now I'm gonna try to find better shelter. And the calm didn't last long. The uh, northern eye wall is kind of once again scraping into this area. And uh, you can see a boat kind of getting blown ashore, um, almost coming up onto the road. And you can see how the water is just almost up onto the road. It's really high, so talking a matter of the inches before it floods the road. And the storm's picking back up again. Looks like we're back in the northern eye wall around the edge of it. And a strong east wind, or I think east, is uh, blowing across the road and blowing water onto the road. And I'm worried about this area flooding, so I'm uh, trying to get north to uh, the next town up called La Rose. They have a high bridge there. I'm thinking if I could just get there, I can get the car on the bridge and uh, at least safe from the water. Let's see. See if I can make it. And I am not going to get out of this town tonight. There's no way. Uh, the driving conditions are just very dangerous. And a lot of debris in the road. You can't see where you're going. Uh, I found this hospital though on a slight hill. It seems like it has a few feet of elevation. And so I'm going to ride out the rest of Isaac here.
5 a.m. I'm at Lady of the Sea General Hospital and we're in the eye. It's very calm. And this is the north entrance. During the storm, the, uh, the windows almost broke, so they had to put it. 7.30 and we're still in the eye. But the uh, pressure's edged up a couple of millibars and also that wind sock over there is now showing that the winds have shifted to the south. And more than six hours after the lull started, there are signs that the backside of the hurricane is moving in. Heading on the 182 into Homa, and 24 hours after the brunt of Hurricane Isaac hit, it is still going strong. I'm almost there, just a little further.